Hi. For this week's best lesson plan question, I chose a third grade lesson on ostinato and tempo. And within the objectives of ostinato and tempo, I decided to reinforce things such as dynamics, articulation, like differentiating between legato and staccato, and quarter notes, eighth notes, quarter rests, bar lines, and repeat signs. I did this by using In the Hall of the Mountain King by Edward Grieg, and in the lesson, the students learned and talked about what makes music interesting. I handed out laminated sheets with the rhythmic ostinato for the piece on it, and together the students and I tapped out the rhythm of the ostinato while listening to the piece. The students loved this piece in general, so it wasn't hard to get good responses as to how the composer makes the piece interesting to them. Um, but my cooperating teacher and I have this one third grade class in particular that is just not interested and enthusiastic about music at all. And no matter how much we threaten them about their grades or we try and get them involved, they just act like they don't really care. So I knew that there were a lot of athletes in this particular class because it's filled with mostly boys. And so I used Queen's We Will Rock You to further demonstrate and reinforce the concept of ostinato. And I had to use an instrumental version of the song because the lyrics aren't necessarily appropriate for elementary school. Um, but I found a version, and the link is on my lesson plan, in which um, the electric guitar plays the melody throughout. So then I had the students sing, sing along with the chorus to, of We Will, We Will Rock You. And um, there's even a section during like the coda at the end where I let the kids kind of play the air guitar along with the electric guitar. And it was really funny because I'd never seen this class more engaged or excited about music and about learning in music class. So I would say that this is my best lesson, mainly because I was really able to relate and connect to something those students knew and enjoy um, and enjoyed. I would say that the most challenging part, however, about this lesson was classroom management. You know, it's hard to find that happy medium between the cool being the cool teacher and being the teacher who's trying to teach and be the authority in the class. So, you know, I felt like I gained the students' respect, but I still had to crack down on some of the students who thought, you know, I was cool that they could get away with anything. I was so cool that they could get away with anything. And, you know, I would say that that's the most difficult part. But it was interesting to see that after the We Will Rock You section, I immediately gained their respect and attention that I needed to continue the lesson. So I could have taught them anything in the world after that because they just thought I was the coolest teacher ever. <laughs>